Now this is what I call an autumn morning. Hello guys and welcome to Vlogtober Day 21. Today Mike and I are walking the pups but I'm actually off to London this afternoon, well this morning, um, I leave in about an hour because I am doing a little feature on this morning which is really exciting but also really scary. I don't know if you guys saw, if you're based in the UK you might have seen it. Last time I did a little beauty feature on there um, it was about wacky beauty trends and this time I'm doing a skincare thing. So it's not live, it's going to go up next Wednesday I think, um, but I'm still pretty nervous. And we're just coming for a walk, I've got my coffee with the pheasants and my gross lipstick mark on the side. Mike's got his tea with cars on and we have many dogs as we did last night. Um, and yeah, that is an update for today. I'm also doing an interview, I think with Radio 4. Um, this afternoon. So yeah, come along to London and we'll see where we get. Growl is climbing a tree! She is the most stealthy cat. So I'm early for my train for once and I'm sitting here and I have hair on my face. Ah! Um, in the beautiful sunshine with a cup of coffee. And I think I have about 10 minutes to wait. But it's quite a nice day. It's one of those days it's like really crisp and cold. Um, and my eye is giving me so much dip. It's been like watering. So I hope my makeup is going to stay on. Okay guys, so I'm in the green room with this morning right now and I just did my little piece to camera and actually it wasn't too bad. It, I was so nervous when I was doing the live one last time. It's so much better doing a pre-recorded one but I think I'm actually going to be potentially in the studio next week as well, live. So now I have nerves all over again. But this is what the green room looks like. It's actually green. And other than that, not too exciting. There's a TV and lots of food and stuff. And a lamp. And I'm actually trying to upload all of my vlog videos whilst I'm in here and I have um, fast internet because my internet has been so bad recently that is why all of my vlogs are late so I'm really sorry guys but I'm trying my best to get them to you ASAP and yeah I'm not sure what I'm doing now. My camera just ran out of battery, disaster. Anyway I was actually meant to have an interview this afternoon but we've run over here so um, I'm gonna have to do it again tomorrow. So now I have a load of free time in London. What do you do with free time in London? Maybe go shopping. I may have got a little bit carried away in Topshop. I'm in the dressing rooms right now. This is my pile of stuff to try on. And there's one more outside as well. I had like 13 things. I also thought I might do a quick outfit of the day whilst I'm here um, because I have a full length mirror and I have no good full length mirrors at home. So why not? So the mirror is actually pretty dirty, but this is my outfit with my coat on. I have my Marge coat. And then underneath, I'm going to take the coat off. Underneath, I have on, I forgot to put my necklace back on. I actually got changed um, for the this morning thing, but I did have on my J. Crew necklace. This is from H&M. I've got a Massimo D t-shirt and a Topshop mini skirt, which I've worn so much, like worn it to death. Um, black tights and my Geox Riley boots. That is my outfit of the day in the dirtiest mirror in the world. Okay, so number one, fringed t-shirt. I think I quite like this. I have it tucked into my skirt, um, which is a bit awkward because I have like the massive security tag but I quite like this I think it's quite cool in the back yeah no what do you guys think the next thing is this waxed shirt which I think I might need in a smaller size kind of looks a bit like boxy I'm not so sure about this the woman next door is having a hilarious conversation as well and next up I have this like twisted top which again I think I need a smaller size because it's really really loose and this little like squat thing that's actually shorts at the back I actually quite like these. I think I'm going to get this in a smaller size and try. I quite like them together too. I think they're quite cute. really like this. I think it's so cute. Look at the detail. Such a good little black dress. I'm not sure about this dress because I need something for um, the This Morning thing next week. And I wanted something with sleeves. And I have this dress, the same cut in um, the same print as my skirt. So this print, which is the same like stripey one that Beyonce wore last year, if any of you guys remember. But. I don't know about the colour. Okay, more casual this time. I actually quite like this jumper. It's huge. It has really cool, like, double neck detail. And the jeans, I like when this is on. I don't like them, like, this part. I don't think my flash ring there. So I did pretty well in Topshop. I have a bag. Um, and I'm just walking along Oxford Street. I've got to leave in about 10 minutes to get my train, but someone tweeted me a picture of a sausage dog handbag that I wanted to get for my little niece. And I think it was in Primark. For some reason I don't have 3G today. It's really annoying, I haven't had it all day. But on a side note as well, the Christmas lights are up. They're not lit, but they're up. That is exciting. I think they're gonna look really cool this year because they're all just white balls. I like it. So I made it to the train. This is the Ford of rush hour trains. Oh, the delight. Made it back to my car. 
I don't know if it looks dust, so dark, you can't even see I'm in a car. I am in my car. Um, first thing I noticed when I got into my car was how amazing it smelled because, I don't know if you'll be able to see this, can you see that? Because of, um, I'm going to take it off and show you, because of this thing, the Bath and Body Works, oh my goodness, it, I got the um, apple cinnamon no pumpkin apple and it smells so good and the guy when i was in the shop was like oh because i bought two one for my car and one for mike's and the guy was like oh it's um three buy three get one free and i was like oh i don't want to like overstock because i might not like it i wish i had bought extra now because i freaking love it it's so it smells so good and i'm trying to like get it back in the little vent thing there we go anyway um so i'm actually going straight to the pub to meet mike for dinner because one of our friends is back in town who we haven't seen in ages so we're going out for dinner which is nice it's about three minutes to eight right now um and i was going to say something else and i've forgotten what it was oh i've been listening i still have my headphone and i'm probably shouting actually because it's like half deaf um i've been listening to taylor swift's new song on repeat first time i heard it i was like mm, not too sure welcome to new york i was like oh i'm not too sure now i'm like obsessed and every time i listen to it it makes me want to be in new york because yeah why wouldn't you because it's called welcome to new york i'm home and with pig <laughs> nice to see you too little licky face i do love you um mike has said that i need to vlog now wow. because he's got something to show me i right. don't know what it is so what is this on every occasion that you try and light a candle you have an issue don't you I don't Where have a lighter. Where is the blowtorch? Because the blowtorch is my weapon of choice, not yours. So instead, I have brought you this. Oh, well, thank you. A candle lighter. A candle clicker lighter. This is how Wait, much I'm just I gonna treat put you. It down. You know, your daily. This is what you get treated with as a present. Thank you, my love. What else have you got behind your back? That was it. Oh, why have you still got your hands behind your back? Because I'm. Oh, because you're weird, young gentleman. Check that out. He knows how to spoil a girl. I've also got some fire lighters, but I don't think they're for you. They're for me, really. For really? Mm. Yeah. Well, that's going to be it for today, guys. We went out to the pub, and actually our friend's parents joined us too, which was really nice. Um, oh. It was delightful. So, because they're kind of like old family friends, so mm. I've grown up with both of the kids because they're really close in age and so we know their parents really well too so it was really nice to catch up with them and yes i'm back off to london tomorrow for more meetings and uh tanya's launch party which you're Check you out to. no i am <laughs> gardening um, hopefully because you know what happened today i went to mow the lawns today and the bbc said there was going to be no rain and you know what happened it rained well it didn't rain in london haha <laughs> we'll see you guys tomorrow bye bye with my clicker. Good morning and welcome to Vlogtober day 20. Um, that was kind of X Factor style. 20. Um, today I have no makeup on because I'm going to be filming.